I haven't done a fact video in a long time, but in this video I'm going to be doing a fact video on Momoshige Otozuki since the tuning exam arc is going to be starting soon. I just feel like it's a perfect timing, it's a perfect marriage for this video, and I love fact videos as well. Now without wasting any of you guys' time, going into the first fact about Momoshiki Otsuzuki. Now, the first fact is that Momoshiki has 5 Keke Genkai, and I know, that's crazy right, 5 Keke Genkai. If a warrior has 1 Keke Genkai, it would be completely overpowered, but this guy has 5 of them. If you guys want me to name them, he has 1 the Byakugan, he has 2 the Rinnegan, he has 3 the Wood Style Release, he has lava style release and he also has ice style release that off top is absolutely crazy we already know what the Byakugan is the Renegon of course gives you so much hacks abilities not to mention the wood style the Hashirama Jutsu and no Momoshiki doesn't have any Hashirama cell I know somebody's gonna ask that in the comment section below it's just natural in terms of overpoweredness and just Momoshiki being flat out talented and flat out better than a lot of people it's gonna be there so Momoshigi definitely talented definitely one of the strongest characters or definitely one of the strongest villains that we've ever seen in the Naruto verse thus far now in my opinion I feel like the wood style could possibly be a little bit interesting as you guys know wood style can kind of control the nine tails and I don't really know much about that like but we do know that Hashirama controlled the nine tails when Madara actually used it and we also know that Yamato controlled Naruto every time he went bonkers and used the nine tails chakra so that's something to look out for in terms of the Momoshiki and Naruto connection, the Momoshiki and Naruto fight. We know that Momoshiki didn't really use that or it didn't really control Naruto a lot in the Boruto tuning exam movie. But in terms of the anime, I feel like they're going to span it out. They're going to stretch out a lot of the fights. And this could possibly be something that we can look out for. The second fact about Momoshiki is the fact that Momoshiki is the son of Kenshiki. And this was something kind of surprising to me. Mainly because Kenshiki always spoke about Momoshiki as being like this lord and savior. Like he always held Momoshiki at a higher regard. He'd always say Lord Momoshiki and things like that. But it's kind of crazy that Momoshiki is actually his son. Now Kenshiki is basically saying that he's the guardian of Momoshiki and it's kind of interesting that Momoshiki seems to be stronger than Kenshiki even though he's the son. I'm not completely sure if it's the fact that Kenshiki is old or it's the fact that Momoshiki is just flat out more talented than everybody else in the Otsuzuki clan. Not necessarily everybody in the Otsuzuki clan but flat out more talented than Kenshiki and possibly even Urashiki. Hopefully we get to see Urashiki soon but this was like an interesting fact that I didn't know until like a couple of weeks ago. Fact number three is the fact that Momoshiki has two different designs and both both of the designs were actually confirmed by Kishimoto himself. Now, a lot of people have been kind of confused about this. There's actually two forms of Momoshiki, and every time I post this second form of Momoshiki, a lot of people are kind of confused, like, hey, who is this guy? But this is the Momoshiki from the manga, and this is the Momoshiki right here from the anime, or the movie, per se. Now, both of these designs were actually confirmed by Kishimoto. Now, whichever one they use in the anime, I have no idea, but I think the consensus is that the one that was used in the manga the one right here is definitely the most cooler or the cooler one out of the two and I feel like if they use either one it's fine with me as I said but if the majority says they want to see this one the one in the manga I feel like that's the one that they should actually put in the anime and I won't be mad at that at all because this one looks very cool now the fourth fact is the fact that Momoshiki has showcased 17 different jutsus in the boruto universe now this is kind of interesting you guys might not think this is very interesting mainly because only 17 we probably seen like a thousand jutsus from kakashi or something like that but this is interesting to me mainly because we've seen momoshiki in a short span of time i mean like probably i would say like completely 20 30 minutes of time and we've already seen 17 jutsus from momoshiki and i feel like that right there is definitely amazing now of course in the anime the fights are going to be longer the momoshiki urushiki and kenshiki versus the five kage and sasuke fight is probably going to be anywhere from like three episodes to like 10 episodes it'll probably be that crazy and in the movie it was only about i'd say 20 minutes or something like that and we've only seen 17 jutsus from momoshiki so in the anime i do expect to see a lot more for example go out to lava style some ice style some wood style things like that and i feel like those jutsus would be absolutely amazing to see animated and the writers have so much creativity to work with from momoshiki because momoshiki could basically do anything and everything that he wants to do in terms of ninjutsu based attacks the fifth fact about momoshiki otozuki is the fact that his main thing like this his go-to move is to absorb chakra now of course we know that momoshiki has renegades on his arms or he has renegades on his 
hands and he basically uses that to absorb chakra and not only absorb the chakra he also reflects the chakra at an intensified rate for example when B released the tail beast bomb on Momoshiki Otsuzuki Momoshiki basically used that same tail beast bomb and basically destroyed I mean completely destroyed the tuning exam not to mention he already used a bit of that chakra that he did get from B to actually use that beast bomb on B himself so Momoshiki is definitely going to be an interesting guy to look at in terms of what he's actually going to do and what he can possibly do and I think Momoshiki's Jutsu is probably going to be like a precursor to see what the Jutsus that we do see in the future are going to be like. For example, when we did see Time Space and then Jutsu from Obito, and little did we know that the rest of Naruto was going to be like a lot of Time Space and Jutsu. But these were five facts about Momoshiki Otsuzuki. I think this guy is going to be really cool. Let me know what you guys think about these five facts in the comment section below. And if you guys have more facts on Momoshiki Otsuzuki, please tell me in the comment section below. But it's been your boy Barbie, and we out. For oh, my city, I'm the youngest nigga rapping. Oh my God, oh my God, if I die, I'm a legend. Oh my God, oh my God, if I die, I'm a legend. I'm a first.